Hey guys, welcome back to Burst of Sunshine. It's Ashley. For today's project, I decided I'm going to show you how I decorated my cute file cabinet. I needed a new filing system and I was trying to get organized for the new year. This was an old, rusty, beat up file cabinet that I got really cheap at a thrift store. Anyways, I hope you guys like this video on how I decorated my pretty file cabinet. If you want to see how i done it, just keep watching. All right, we are gonna start with a file cabinet. Any file cabinet you want. I got this old rusted one that's cheap from a thrift store and I'm gonna beautify it. So let's get started. I'm going to use an electric sander. You can use a piece of sandpaper. Some glasses, of course, to protect your eyes and gloves. And we're just gonna sand this down so it is smooth, so the paint gives a smooth finish. Now we're gonna spray paint it with some light pink spray paint. I just done a thin coat, let it dry, done another coat, just cause I didn't wanna pile too much on at one time and let it start running. So once you get this completely covered, you can paint your handle, which is completely optional. I painted mine white. And now I'm going to take this stencil. I got this stencil actually at Walmart. It is the Waverly brand. And it almost kind of sort of reminded me of a quattro foil, but it had so much more details, which I loved. So I just placed this where I wanted it and then taped it down to kind of make it stay. Well, the best I could anyways. And I'm going to take some white acrylic paint and a flat sponge brush. And I'm just going to dab this on. And I actually let it dry completely. And then I painted a second layer. And then I peeled the stencil off. And you can, of course, fix any places on it where uh, it didn't cover with go with paint or it got out of the lines a little bit. Just take a little small paintbrush and then fix them. For the side that it did not get done because my stencil was not wide enough, I did just take the stencil and kind of pull, eyeball it and place it where it needed to go. Of course, I've done the same thing for the bottom. It's super easy. You legit just stick this stencil where you want it and then paint it. It's like, I mean, it's that easy. I only painted the doors because I wanted it to stick out from the rest of the cabinet. And you can, of course, seal this in with a sealer if you want. I did not, and mine seems to be holding up fine. And that is all you do. That is it. I know, right? It's so cute. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you liked it. If you did, don't forget to hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe. All right, guys, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.